First pitch is a strike to Kemp. Hooked foul and it's 0 2. Seems like extended at bats. Rodriguez to his left. He makes the catch. Yeah, guys. Spikes. But they have to be quality strikes. You can't just. Behooved you to get ahead. Uh, being ahead helps. Got him swinging. First pitch is down and in. At the plate, there's never been a bigger gap. Good pitch right on the outside corner, two and two. Now Raleigh sets up low and strike three called right at the knees. Kirby has retired 13 in a row. He's got eight strikeouts. We're going to the bottom of the sixth inning. It's the A's one and the Mariners nothing. So he leads things off here in the bottom of the sixth. First pitch oh, should have been a strike. Called the ball. If the pitch to Seth Brown was a strike, Seth Brown is over there. I just saw put up his hand like, yeah. what? Yep. That was, <laughs> and they just threw somebody out. Somebody from the dugout just got thrown out. Mark Kotze is going to come out. Chris Siegel is a home plate umpire, and if you, the, the pitch to Seth Brown that he got called out on was less of a strike than pitch that Julio Rodriguez just got called as a ball. Funny, so as we've done many times before, if a broadcaster makes a claim that can be fact-checked, we will do the check. So here's the claim that the strike three to Seth Brown was less of a strike than ball one to Julio Rodriguez. Let's all stipulate that the phrase, quote, less of a strike simply means the pitch was located farther from center, height-wise in the case of the strike zone. Called a strike. This pitch here, more of a strike is called a ball. So there's your argument. So as the numbers state, that is simply not true. Now, both pitches were rated strikes by the public facing computer. No doubt about that. But here's the thing. The umpire will get a post-game score that will say that the ball call was correct. The public says it's wrong, but the private computer that the umpire and only the umpire sees will say it's right. Public graphics, which are super misleading in this case because they make it look like the pitch that was actually farther away was closer than the pitch that was actually closer, will tell everyone the umpire blew it, and UEFLFX numbers support that notion. However, the ML private zone eval equivalent numbers, and remember, zone evaluation is the private proprietary, whatever you want to call it, system behind the scenes that umpires are evaluated by the league office itself. That's Manfred's territory. Those numbers will tell the umpire and will tell the league office that both calls were correct. And both individuals would like to be rewarded with that on the mound. The hitters would be okay with having an idea that that's a strike. The discrepancy between public versus private systems and how it can look one way for the public and one way behind the scenes for the private. We have discussed this for years. We've brought up the problems for years. But MLB has kind of created this problem because they are so eager for this electronic strike zone for the fans, but the technology simply isn't there yet to actually install it during gameplay. That's what needs to be fixed, and until that happens, you get these arguments, which, honestly, I think the leagues kind of likes to see. If you haven't pieced it together yet, we've been nerds about this for years. The same problems happen time and time again, and we've talked nearly all of them several times over. Check out CloseCallSports.com and the label Computer Strike Zone to read our extensive history writing about this. But it's a man-made controversy. Really, the system isn't good enough yet. The leak knows that. Manfred admitted as much during a prior Q&A that was very niche, very esoteric, narrow audience. But they know the problems. They know it exists. Or if they, quote, don't, the Atlantic League sure does. Disagreeing with you, you're going to take it out by throwing out somebody from the dugout. And, and let's remember, from an umpire's perspective, you don't have any more friends in that third base dugout than you do in that first base dugout. You're hearing it from both sides. 